Hello, Kula here. Uh, in this video, I have my May secret shop purchase from Julep. I believe this is my first time I've ever had a secret shop invitation, but I believe you have to be a maven, and it's like the first of the month the secret shop opens. Like I said, I don't know if this is the first time I was ever able to access the secret shop. Um, so I only bought one like little set thing. There's two boxes here um, because what had happened is this was missing from my initial order. Uh, but Julep was really great. I just emailed customer service and they apologized and they shipped it off fairly quickly. Um, so that wasn't a big deal at all. Uh, that's actually the second time I've used Julep's customer service. Uh, the other time was my add-ons from my May box. I didn't get a shipping confirmation for, so I was a little concerned and I emailed them and they got back to me within like three or four days, but they were pretty swamped with emails, I think, because they were having issues with their, their shipping and their tracking. So that's fine. I mean, I could have called them and I could have got a hold of them sooner, but I preferred to email, so that's what I did. So the both times I've used Julep's customer service, I mean, they've resolved my issues easily. They were kind, they apologized, so nothing but good experience with that. Um, but so for my May secret shop purchase, I got like it's called the spring skincare cleaning, spring cleaning set. I don't remember what it was called, but it had um their body frosting, the body scrub, and then the Korean scrub mitten towel. And it also came with an additional polish. So this was only like $17, so I thought it was a really good deal and a really great way to try some of the products I've been meaning to try. Um, just because like, you know, a traditional like regular body butter from the store is like 20 bucks. So for $17, I got all this fun stuff. Um, so kind of go through the, this is the first original box I got here. Um, so they include this, kind of talks about their polishes and uh, their girlfriend, right? Is this one that talks about the girlfriend program? No, this one doesn't, but it just kind of talks about their products a little. Uh, and then this is the card that came with it, Social Beauty. And it kind of shows you like how you can get a hold of them. Alright, so in this I have used these products before, you know, because I like to give you guys a review of them. Uh, so kind of start off with here, this is the Pink Grapefruit Body Scrub. Uh, I really want to try this because I really want to start using scrubs, especially with summer coming up. Like I said, this is used, so it's kind of not as pretty as it would have been. And this did have a seal on it too. Um, that was another thing, these both came sealed, but when I first opened the frosting, it didn't look like it was, which kind of concerned me, so when I searched on YouTube, I saw other people opening boxes, and they just twisted off the top and were able to smell it, so I assumed it wasn't sealed, uh, but then one day I opened it, and all of a sudden there was a seal on it, so I was really confused, and I think what had happened is the seal, the seal wasn't on this one, like, very strong, it was super easy to peel off, so I think what had happened is it had got stuck in the cap, and when I unscrewed it, it just took it off completely and hid it in the cap for me. Uh, but, you know, no big deal. It didn't look used or anything. But this is the scrub here. Uh, I was a little concerned about the pink grapefruit smell because I'm not a big fan of a pink grapefruit smell. But it's actually not that bad and it does not linger, which is nice. So here's the body scrub here and then this is the body frosting. Pink grapefruit. I don't know if you can see that. This, this label is like violently pink. And this lighting's not too good right now because it's overcast out, unfortunately. Uh, but this is what it looks like. I mean, it, frosting is a very good description of this product. It's very, very whipped, very light, um, very easy to put on. And once again, like, there, I mean, you can smell grapefruit, but it's... It, it's not even, like, sweeter. I don't even know how to explain it. Maybe there's, like, vanilla-y... Almost, but it's, it's a soft grapefruit smell. It's not tangy, it's not harsh. And like I said, the smell does not linger, which I actually like, because I prefer to wear scents, you know, in mist form or like perfumes. So I really appreciated that. I do really like this body frosting. It feels really good to put on, and it's very easy to put on, just because it is so whipped and creamy. The body scrub, I'm not so sure how I feel about. I've only used it a couple times. I almost feel like it leaves this weird film on me. Like I've used I use it in the shower and then I rinse it off, but I still feel like there's this weird almost oily film. 
it's hard to like it's hard to explain unless you feel it but I think if you've used a product that makes you feel filmy and greasy afterwards you know what I'm talking about the body frosting has that feeling to an extent but it does absorb pretty quickly so it, it was never an issue like I put it on and then like maybe like a minute later my skin felt really soft and not greasy at all but with the scrub it, it really stuck around like even after I got out of the shower and dried off uh, so I don't know, and uh, you know it is it is a sugar scrub, so it does dissolve pretty quickly if you're not fast enough. So I almost find myself using more of it than I want to. Uh, but I mean, it, it does feel good. It does help soften my skin. But I do prefer the body frosting over the body scrub. Uh, and then this box, I also got a sample of the Rockstar hand cream. I like I said, like I love these little sample packets. I love using them at work. I love keeping them in my bag. Uh, this is good for, you know, two, three good applications, and I love this stuff. And then the polish it came with, uh, it is this one here. It is called Delani. That's how you say that, right? Delani. And it's from the Tina, the Trina Turk line, the fall 2012 line. And right here. And Julep describes this as a chili pepper red cream. And it is a very bright red polish. Like, an extremely, like that, I think chili pepper red is a very accurate description of this. Um, to be honest, like, the nail polish didn't wow me. It's not why I bought this set. It was a really great addition, and I'm really excited to have it. But this color is super bright. Like, it's a super bright red, as you can see there. And I just, I don't know if I could pull that off. I don't know. But it's super bright. It is pretty. It's a great polish. My only qualm well issue with it I suppose is the brush is kind of curved. I don't know if you can see this. I don't want to like spill polish all over my floor I'm trying to figure out a way to show you but it's like it was curved and I don't know if that's going to affect there you go see if you can see that. Affect how it goes on or not um, but like I said like this wasn't a color I was you know over the moon about so that's not too big of a deal so that was the first package I got um, that's everything, but it was missing the towels, so like I said, all I had to do was email Julep, and they sent them off for me here, and then this is what I got for that. Another sample of the Rockstar hand cream, and then they sent the cards again, so same card, Social Beauty, talking about their products, and then I actually just got these, so I haven't opened them yet, uh, but I hear these are really good for exfoliation. So you get a little hand mitt here, so you can see, and then a nice little towel here. So I'm really excited to try these. Um, I don't know much about them, but I do know that they're they're really good for exfoliation, for getting rid of dead skin, and they do feel they feel really gentle, which is nice. Like I've had some exfoliation things that just are too much, especially for the skin on my back, which is really sensitive for some reason. So I am really excited to use these. I'm really happy to have gotten them, and I'm really, I really appreciate Julep uh, being on top of things and mailing them out to me so quickly. So that is my very first Secret Shop purchase. It's from the May Secret Shop. Uh, you know, I, really, I like all the products. Some I was expecting a little bit more from, uh, but for what I paid, like the $17, I'm not going to complain. So that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching.